What is up, YouTube? In today's video, we're going to be going over the things that we absolutely love about our Subaru Outback Wilderness. Now, we bought this car brand new from the dealership with zero miles, and in just a year and a half, we have put over 25,000 miles on this car. We've taken this car on countless road trips, camping trips, overlanding trips, and these are the things that we found that we absolutely love while owning this car. This list is not gonna be in any particular order and we are not sponsored with Subaru. So everything you guys hear and see in this video is completely our own personal experience and our own personal opinion while having this car. With that being said, let's get started with number one and that's the all-wheel drive system. Now Subaru is known for their all-wheel drive system and this car does not disappoint. If you guys have seen any of our videos, we've taken this car on countless road trips on dirt, on sand, on mud, on rock. It is just really good on all those different terrains. If you're planning on taking a road trip across the country and you hit all four seasons, this car just gives you the confidence that it can get you through any terrain. Um, now, it is not a rock crawler. Um, I'm not saying you're going to be, you know, driving over boulders or anything. But in terms of light roads, light trails, forest roads, mud, sand, wet, dry conditions, this thing has just been awesome for us. And it's been super reliable in terms of getting us out in sticky situations. <laughs> Now, before we get to number two, make sure to hit that subscribe button if you are not subscribed yet. At the time of making this video, we are just 80 subscribers away from hitting our first milestone of 1,000 subscribers. So if you watch my videos on a daily, on a regular, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button. It really helps out the channel. And let's continue on with number two. Now, number two would be the interior of this car. And we're talking about the space and the materials that this car is made out of. Being the outdoor people that my family is, you guys can imagine how dirty this car gets on a long camping trip and a long overlanding trip. And the seats are made out of this pleather-like material that's very, very easy to clean. Um, most of the time, we just take a paper towel and a little bit of water and everything just wipes right off. Super convenient for us. Like I said, we're always getting dirty in the dirt and the mud and stuff like that. In terms of the interior space, it's also a very comfortable space while going on a long road trip. All the seats in the car have heated seats. So the two front seats and even the back seats have heated seats. So I'm about 5'11", just to put in perspective, and I could fit anywhere in the car. I could sit in the front and back, and I'll just be just as comfortable. So we also love the wagon-sized trunk in this car. You could fit so much cargo. It's it's There's just so much space, and we love it. Um, if you guys have seen any of our videos, my wife and I actually fold the seats forward, and we car camp directly from the back of our car. So by camping inside the car, we're able to be protected from the weather. If we're going camping and it starts raining or it's snowing, you know, camping in the back just shields us from the weather and it's awesome. So we love the interior space, the interior materials, and just the overall comfort of being inside this car. It's great for long road trips to be in a comfortable space like that. And yeah, this car doesn't disappoint. So number three would be the eyesight system. Now, what is the eyesight system? It is just Subaru's version of their adaptive cruise control, where it applies the brakes, the gas, and it keeps you centered in your lane, hands-free. Um, while it is hands-free, I'm not gonna say that this is autopilot because it's not even close to autopilot. And it doesn't work well in backcountry roads or any twisty roads. It just doesn't work well in those conditions. But if you're going on a five, six hour stretch on the highway and it's mostly straight, this car will pretty much drive itself and it is awesome. If you have long stretches of driving, it helps with just fatigue. You know, you could take your hands off the wheel for a second and you know, stretch your hands, take your foot off the brakes, off the gas and just let the car cruise. It also helps out with gas mileage as well. So just doing the adaptive cruise control, it works really, really well. And the eyesight system in this car was surprisingly really, really good. Like I said, it is not autopilot, but in terms of those straight roads, I would say, yeah, it's semi-autopilot. It works well, and it works really well for us. <laughs> so another safety feature of the eyesight is that it automatically brakes for you when it detects a car, a person, or any object in front of you. 
The one time I was driving at night on the highway and it was pitch black and I had the eyesight system on and it actually stopped out of nowhere and I had no idea why and all of a sudden this mountain lion runs across the highway. Now the car saw it before I did because it broke for me and you know, it kind of freaked me out. I was like, ooh, what did it see? But it was actually a mountain lion running across the highway. So in terms of the eyesight system, it's also a good safety thing. So when people cut you off or maybe the cars come to a complete stop all of a sudden, the eyesight system will apply brakes for you as well. So we love that it's also a safe system. So just a pro tip, if the visibility conditions are low, then the eyesight system will not work. Uh, one time we were driving through Tahoe and it was just starting to snow really, really hard. And the eyesight system actually disabled itself because it couldn't see. So if you can't see, then the eyesight system also can't see. <laughs> but in terms of that, it has worked really, really great for us. We love the safety aspect of it, you know, when we have our family traveling with us. And yeah, it's a great system. We love it. So number four would be its looks. Now we know looks are subjective, but to us, we absolutely love the way this car looks. It looks rugged on the outside. It looks rugged on the inside. Just adventure ready if you're an outdoors person. Now the interior is all gold stitch. It's got the wilderness badging all over this car. It's got it on the outside, in the back, on the dash, on your door panel. You know it's a wilderness because it's literally stitched everywhere in this car. And to us, we just love the way it looks. It looks a little bit more aggressive than a stock Outback. And yeah, it just looks rugged right out the box, ready for adventure. So to us, we love the way it looks. Now, number five would be X mode. Now, X mode kind of ties in with number one, the all wheel drive system. But what is X mode? X mode is pretty much Subaru's system where if it detects a little wheel spin, the car will break that wheel and force it to the wheels that are on the ground. So say you're on a forest road and you're three wheeling it and one wheel's up in the air, the car will break that wheel and force that torque into the other wheels that are on the ground and the ones that have traction. Now this system has worked really, really well for us. Uh, we've tackled some very slippery conditions, you know, dirt roads, rainy season, mud, snow, and this thing just does everything for you. We find that it actually works a little bit better when you keep your foot on the throttle. Um, you know, when you're driving in that moment, it's hard to sometimes keep your foot down, especially when you hear a little bit of slippage. But yeah, we found that if you keep your foot down a little bit, the system will most likely figure it out. Like I said, we've, we've been on some crazy terrains, crazy road conditions, and the X mode has worked really, really good for us. So those are the things that we absolutely love about our Subaru Outback Wilderness after having it for 25,000 miles. Uh, we love the all-wheel drive system. We love the interior space, the comfort, and the cargo space. We love the eyesight system of this car and the adaptive cruise control. It's worked really, really great for long, long road trips. We love the way it looks, how rugged it looks, out of the box, you don't really have to do much. And we love the X mode. <laughs> Now those are the things that we absolutely love about the Subaru Outback Wilderness, but this car is not perfect. And so if you guys wanna see the things that we absolutely hate about this car, I will leave a link of that video right here. And if you guys wanna see us attempt a four x four trail in this stock Subaru Outback Wilderness, I'll leave a link of that video right here. And as always, stay safe, and I'll see you guys at the next one. Peace.